Hi guys, welcome to the Catway. So in this video, we are going to solve our daily set. And before we begin, do not forget to like, share, and subscribe. Also, those who are uh, those those who are solving it for the first time, you should pause the video, try it yourself, and only then you should see the solution. Okay. Chalo. So let's see what do we have. So we have been given that there are ten boxes, namely box one, two, three, up till box ten, with Mister Zero. Now each of these ten boxes is colored with one out of the four colors, namely black, white, yellow, and pink. Now the number of coins in these boxes is one of the five numbers: twelve, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, and thirty. Okay. And the following bar graphs provides information about the number of boxes that are colored black, white, yellow, and pink, and also the number of boxes that have different number of coins. So we have in out of the ten boxes that we have, there there is one box which is colored in pink. There is one box. Uh, there are two boxes of yellow color, two boxes of white color, and five boxes of black color. That is what we have, and we have been given that the number of boxes which have at least ten, twelve coins. So definitely, all of them will be having it because those are the only five, and twelve is the smallest number. So definitely, at least twelve coins is available within each of the boxes. Now, at most fifteen, fifteen uh, coins. That means the boxes which contain twelve and fifteen coins, they are at most four. So a total of four boxes. So uh, four or below. Okay. Then at least twenty coins. So for that, what do you have is that uh, there are six uh, boxes which have. A minimum of twenty coins. That is between twenty, twenty-five, and thirty. Okay. Now, uh, for at least twenty-five coins, there are five boxes. That means what do you have is that twelve, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. These four numbers are present in five of the boxes. And similarly, at most twenty-five coins. So at most twenty-five coins are available in at most. Uh, uh, sorry, at least twenty-five means there is twenty-five and thirty coins available in five boxes. And at most twenty-five means. 12 15 20 and 25 are available in eight boxes okay so this is what we have chalo so first thing that guys we are going to do is ki let's say uh, the number of boxes uh, see let us denote uh, the number of boxes with 12 15 20 25 and 30 coins as c12 c15 c20 c25 and c30 so these are the number of boxes that means c12 is the number of boxes which contain 12 coins c15 is the number of boxes which contain 15 coins and so on okay now what you have been given is that at least 12 coins okay at least 12 coins means ki there are 12 coins wale boxes 15 coins wale boxes 20 coins wale boxes 25 coins wale boxes and 30 coins wale boxes the total number is 10 similarly at most 15 coins that means the boxes which have 12 12 coins and 15 coins the number for them is 4 right similarly at least 20 coins that means the, the boxes which have 20 or 25 or 30 coins the total number of boxes are 6 at least 25 coins means c25 plus c30 will be equal to 5 and then what do you have is at most 25 so what do you have is c12 plus c15 plus c20 plus c25 the value of this is 8 okay so this is the value that we have now all we have to do is find the values of c1 c c12 c15 c20 c25 and c30 so how will you find you have the equations you just have to put the values and get the solution okay so like what do you have 12 plus 15 plus 20 plus 25 okay so what do you have is the total number is 8 whereas if you add c30 the total number is 10 So from using these two equations, we can get that the value of the number of boxes which contain thirty coins is two, right? So number of boxes of thirty coins is two is what we know. <clears throat> okay. Now if you see C thirty plus C twenty five is equal to five, but C thirty we now is equal to two, so C twenty five will be equal to three, right? Now if you see this one, okay, so C twenty five plus thirty is six, so C twenty will be equal to one, right? C twenty will be equal to one. So this is what you have. Okay, this is what you have. Now, guys, next thing, if you see, twenty plus twenty-five, this again becomes four. That we already know. C twelve plus C fifteen is four, right? We know that. Whereas, also, if you talk about this equation, if you fulfill in that, if you keep your values in that, again, the only thing you are going to get is that C twelve plus C fifteen is equal to four. 
So we are not able to identify the number of boxes which contain 12 coins and 15 coins. Okay, we are not able to identify that. But one thing has been given that no two boxes are colored with the same color, uh, have equal number of coins. Okay, and each of the five boxes has one among, uh, each of the 10 boxes have one among 12, 15, 20, 25, and 30. So the minimum possible number that C12 or C25 could have is one. In that case, the other one will have three coins. So they have a range of either one box or three boxes. So this is what we get. Okay, so this is what we get. Now we can move towards the questions. So the first one is the number of boys that have exactly 20 coins. Uh, boys will know. Sorry, the number of boxes that have exact 20, exactly 20 coins is one. So option number four, one is the right answer. Now, what is the total number of coins in all the boxes that are colored black? So now if you see, there are five boxes of black color, right? There are five boxes of black color, right? And you have five number of coins of five types. Like either it could be 12, 15, 20, 25, or 30. And no two boxes that are colored with same color have equal number of coins. So all these five boxes have different number of coins. That means one box will be having 12, other 15. One box has 20, other has 25, and one of them has 30. So the total number of coins in the black boxes is 102. So the correct answer is option number one. Come to the third one. The total number of coins in all the 10 boxes with me, Mr. Zero can be at most. All right, guys. So we know that the total number of boxes uh, of uh, 30 coins, okay, the total number of boxes of 30 coins are two. So he has two into 30 coins, okay. Uh, 2 into 30 coins, vale. so 30 coins, you have two boxes, so the total number of coins from here you get to be equal to 60. Then you have three boxes which have 25 coins each, so the total number of coins in these three boxes is 75, right? And you have only one box with 20 coins, so you have 20 coins from here, right? But you are unclear about this. But the question is at most, so you have to maximize. So how will you maximize, guys? You can maximize your value when you take three boxes of 15 coins and one box of 12 coins. Okay, that then only you can maximize. So you will have three boxes of 15 coins. That is 45 coins from here and one box of 12 coins. So this is what you have. And the total sum of this goes out to be equal to 212. So at max, Mr. Zero can have 212 coins. That is option number three. So this was a pretty easy set guys and hope you have understood the set well. Thanks for watching the video.